Hey guys, today I want to tell you about a tool I found called Black Hole. It's a great replacement for Mac users that used to use Soundflower and grew tired of it crashing or not working at all. This is the GitHub page for the project. And Black Hole is basically just an audio driver that allows applications to pass audio from one application to another. So the way I installed it is using Homebrew. If you have Homebrew installed on your machine, you can run a simple command to install Black Hole. If you don't have Homebrew, I highly recommend that you do install it. And if we go back to the GitHub page for the Black Hole project and go to the easy installation instructions, this is the command that you run to install it using Homebrew. And in Terminal, that basically looks like this. We run the command and then it's installed. After you install it, you need to go to Audio MIDI Setup and select Black Hole 16 channel as your default output device. Chances are your default output device is currently the built-in output, so switch it to black hole. After that, go to a tool like Reaper and select black hole 16 channel as your audio device. Arm a track, hit record, and then we can go to another application like a browser, play audio. I also like to make sure that the master volume is at about 50% so that I don't clip. So if we go here and play a YouTube video, we should see the audio in Reaper, and we do. So this is high quality stereo audio being captured by Black Hole from the browser. So we can pause that video and then go to another streaming service like Spotify, pick a song, play it, and because the default audio device is now Black Hole, it will record in Reaper. So if we go back to Reaper, we can see that Spotify is being recorded here. So that's basically it. This tool is called Black Hole. You can get it from GitHub. You can install it using Homebrew. And it's a great replacement for Soundflower.